let's move to the next question in this question two pillars of equal height are on either side of a road and the width of the road is 100 meters the angles of elevation of the top of pillars are 60 degrees and 30 degrees and it is observed from a point which is on the road in between the pillars we have to find out the point between the pillars and the height of each pillar let's work out the problem let us draw a simple figure to represent the above question here bc and pq be two pillars of equal height which is h meters then the height of each pillar becomes bc which is equal to pq and it is h meters and we have given the width of the road is 100 meters therefore the distance between pillar bc and pillar pq is 100 meters that means bp is equal to cq which is 100 meters now consider a point a in between two pillars and we have given the angle of elevation of the top of the pillars from this point is 60 degrees and 30 degrees let angle c a b be 30 degrees and angle q a p be 60 degrees and we assume the distance of the point a from the pillar b c be x meters therefore p therefore p a becomes x meters then b a is x meters here we have total length is 100 meters so the distance of the point a from pillar p q is 100 minus x since the total distance is 100 and we have to find a p we get it by subtracting b a from b p that implies a p is 100 minus x here what we suppose is to find the height of each pillar and the distance of the point from each pillar how we get this here we have two unknowns h and x to find these we have two triangles angle triangle c a b and triangle q a p which are right angles so by applying appropriate trigonometric ratios we can find h and x now find it let us find it now consider triangle c a b here we have triangle c a b we have perpendicular c b and base of triangle is a b so which trigonometric ratio we have to consider we have to consider tan or cot so we consider tan and tan of 30 degrees is the ratio of perpendicular to its base here bc is perpendicular and base is ab now substitute its values tan of 30 degrees is 1 upon root 3 from the figure we have bc is h meters and ab is x meters by cross multiplication we get x is equal to h times root 3 therefore we have got the value of unknown x in terms of another unknown h to get the value of h we consider triangle qap here we have triangle qap qp is a perpendicular and ap is base here we consider tan we have tan of angle 60 degrees is the ratio of perpendicular to its base perpendicular is qp and base is ap now substitute its values tan of 60 degrees is under root 3 qp is h meters and ap is 100 minus x meters now let us simplify it by cross multiplication we have root 3 times 100 minus x which is equal to h here we have two unknowns x and h we eliminate x we already got the value of x which is x is h times root 3 by substituting we get root 3 times 100 minus h root 3 which is equal to h and we solve it for h let us distribute root 3 inside the bracket we have root 3 times 100 is 100 times root 3 and h times root 3 times root 3 is h times 3 and on right hand side we have h let us distribute h times 3 which is 3h to rhs we have 100 times root 3 which is equal to h plus 3h 
on rearranging we get 4h is equal to 100 times root 3. To get the value of h, we will divide both sides with the coefficient of h, which is 4. On dividing, we get 25 times root 3. Therefore, we have find the value of h, which is 25 times root 3. But we have given the value of root 3, so we substitute, then we have 25 times root 3. Root 3 is 1.732. By multiplying, we get the value of h approximately to 43. 0.3 meters. Therefore, the height of each pillar is 43.3 meters and we have to find the value of x. So, let us consider x is h times root 3. But we have got h is 25 times root 3. By substituting, we get 25 times root 3 times root 3. Root 3 times root 3 is 3 and we have 25 times 3. Therefore, we have x is 75 meters. What we have assumed h and x in the figure, we have h is height of each pillar and x is the distance of the point from pillar BC. Therefore, we get the value of height of each pillar is 43.3 meters and the distance of the point from pillar BC is 75 meters. And this completes our solution.